What up guys, how you doing? It is Lasty here. Welcome today to, and um, well, as you can see above me, an informed Jamie Vardy party. Now, uh, Vardy actually got upgraded to a 75 overall, I believe it was, last week, a couple of weeks ago. Um, and he has since got an inform, so he's now like 78 rated, which is pretty sweet. So I, think, I figured I would use him in today's squad. Uh, it's actually a pretty nice squad, and we start off in goal with Manuel Neuer. He is, in my opinion, well, he's the highest rated goalkeeper on the game uh, if you don't of course count the uh the the schmeichels the the team of the year version of neuer and stuff like that really rock solid keeper and our defense today is pretty solid too we've got deke meyer at right back one of my favorites uh low rated rare gold card loads of pace amazing physical like he's just such a rock solid player jerome boateng regular version goes into the squad use whichever version of him that it, that you like um if you haven't got enough coins for him then of course there is a uh, new transfer card called tasky who would uh, do the job just as well well, not, not just as well, but he would fit the chemistry just as well. Uh, we then got Mustafi from Valencia in the La Liga. Uh, of course, Valencia not doing too well at the moment under Gary Neville. But uh, hopefully that can uh, can change around a bit. Because we all have a bit of Gary Neville. Hopefully, I wish him success anyway is what I'm trying to say. Gaia in form goes in at left back. One of my favourites on the game. He's actually really, really good. I like him a lot. Now, our inform is all French, but it's two different leagues. We've got the BPL and we've got the Serie A. Uh, this is an upgrade. Kante, I think that's how you pronounce his name. One of the Leicester gods this year. And actually, I cannot recommend this guy highly enough. He is so good in game. A really, really uh, awesome player and a joy to play with. Um, we then got Dimitri Payet. Like, I used this squad before the upgrades came out. You could, of course, use an 82 version of him or, of course, an 83 inform version of him, which is awesome. Amazing. I love Love that Payet's been upgraded. Uh, we've then got team of the year Paul Pogba. Of course, 93 rated. Amazing player. Loads of crazy stats all around. What a god he is. And our strike force is also pretty awesome. We've got Balassi on the left wing. And then two team of the week players from this week's team of the week that I was very, very interested in. Balassi's rapid. He's got five-star skills. He's a very good option out on that left wing. I like him a lot. He's also got quite a bit of strength about him, which, again, I really like. Um... Quadrado, he's one of the players from this week's team of the week. He's 83 rated. He's got 94 pace and 88 dribbling. That's absolutely mental. Of course, five star skill moves, and he's a real tricky player. Um, and then we've got 78 rated in form Jamie Vardy, 92 pace, 76 dribbling, 80 shooting, 80 physical. Um, of course, this isn't the highest rated Jamie Vardy. There is, of course, the record breaker version of him. Um, but I can only imagine his team of the season, which, let's face it, he's going to get um, would be maybe a higher rating than that record breaker. So then we've got that to look forward to in the coming months, I guess. This squad around 2 mil because of Pogba. Of course, use regular Pogba or the inform and you can uh, drastically reduce the price of the squad. Vardy and uh, Quadrado, two players that I'm going to be doing Footwiz player reviews for. So as always, uh, go in the top corner if you want to go and subscribe to Footwiz, watching four extra player review videos from myself every single week. Um, loads of content being made around here. I just love it. I love doing this. Um, this was actually a really good team. I had a session on Thursday night where I played with this team, another squad builder that I'm going to be bringing out on Monday, uh, and also I played the random pick on Thursday as well. So I played like 20 games of Ultimate Team in one night, which is a lot. Um, and if you have a terrible session, it can be one of the most stressful things out there. I didn't have the greatest session in the world, but I didn't get overly stressed out and like throw my controller at my TV and stuff, and maybe I did that once or twice, but we got over it pretty quickly, um, and what we did was score quite a lot of goals. Quadrado got on the score sheet, I think it was like a goal a game, um, and from a right winger, I'm actually quite impressed with that, and Vardy got like more goals uh, in more games or whatever you want to call it better goal to game ratio even than quadrado he was an out and out striker of course so that was always going to happen and uh both of these as i said i will talk about in far more detail over on the footwiz channel but i can say that i'm going to be giving positive reviews for both of them very very solid my favorite part about this team might just be the midfield though uh that trio of payet kante and pogba was just amazing right Payet's like a real flair player um, and he's great at doing what he does he's one of those gems on ultimate team a relatively sort of middle of the road rating for a player but he does this like 
extraordinary job. Um, you then got the upgraded Kante, who was just such a workhorse, more of a defensive-minded player, um, and he was like, it was almost, he felt like a Ramirez on the game, if you know what I mean. Really quick, up and down the pitch, like they're no man's business. Um, and then Pogba, who just has a bit of flair, has a bit of work rate, has an amazing shot. He's just like a little bit of everything, uh, and that's what, of course, his stats do show. Um, and then, of course, getting it up to the strike force, two five-star skillers in this team with Balassi and Quadrado, and and then um, Jamie Vardy, well, he's he's rapid is what he is because he's little and he's got this sort of slender physique. He just feels so friggin' quick on the ball. It's awesome. I love it. Um, and he pushes through on that defense quite well. I didn't notice the high, high work rates to be too much of a problem. Um, if anything, I always felt like he was up in the right position at the right time. So that could that's something to be said for the guy. Um but overall, an enjoyable squad, and if you can afford players like Team of the Year Pogba, they really take this squad from like this level up to this level, which is what exactly what you want. You want a squad which is just going to annihilate your opponents game on, game off. Uh, so that is today's video. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, don't forget to smash that like button. That would be awesome. And of course, subscribe to my channel for more of this type of content. And I will catch you next time, boys. Peace.